Lionel Messi of Argentina is undoubtedly the GOAT of football in the 21st century. The acronym GOAT stands for greatest of all time and Messi is unquestionably the greatest of all time when it comes to football in the modern era. His latest conquest of the FIFA World Cup further cemented the claim as the Argentine captain became the only player to score in the group stages, the round of 16, quarterfinal, semi-final and final as Argentina beat France to lift FIFA World Cup 2022. What a legend and the debate about the greatest player of all time is one that we love to have as football fans. I'm sure you've had it at home many, many times as well with your fellow footballing friends and family. But we're going to have it right now because this is the fun part, isn't it? Now he's won the World Cup. Is he now considered the GOAT? Is there a debate anymore? There's, there's always a debate because it's always going to be about what you think. I think what he's put to bed, though, is the debate of this generation, you know, because he's gone and completed it now. He's won, the, he's won everything in the game. And it was beautiful to watch, you know, from the, the final itself, over in Doha was a spectacle and it just ended up with a like just a beautiful way where he's, you know this this lad because early on in the tournament I, 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 I did the games and he was, was was strolling around and there was question marks about is he and he just he just burst into action yeah. at certain moments and just and just carried his team and it's just a be it's beautiful to watch because I've never seen a player like him what he can do with a ball you know his ability his personality everything and it's just a joy to watch him every time i think he's the greatest player of all time let's have a look on his record given the enormity of everything that he has done and achieved it is unsurprising that messi also belongs in the same conversation a record seven-time winner of the ballon d'or the prize awarded to the best player of the year and the perfect definition of the ultimate goalscorer and modern playmaker messi has been head and shoulders clear of anyone for the best part of well over a decade now Records in history books in football have broken and tumbled in the wake of Messi's genius and at the age of 35, he still continues to wow and mesmerize the world, proving that he is the greatest of the modern era. Lionel Messi has seen and won everything there is in club football and has had a legendary career with FC Barcelona in Spain. He is not only the highest goalscorer in Barcelona's history, but is also the record goalscorer in La Liga and has the most number of assists in that league. In that case, I don't think CR7 um, or R9 or Maradona, uh, I think he's gone above them. I think he stands next to Pelé now. Yeah, well, well, that's a massive statement, isn't it? Isn't it, Jenny? I mean, <laughs> Pelé and Maradona, they had won the World no. Cup and they kind of had that over him potentially, but now they yeah. don't. I just wonder, though, does it matter in what era you've played in as a footballer? Because now it's all about speed and intensity. Back then it maybe was a bit more brutal. No, I think the, the era has to be considered when you're having that mm. debate. But going back to, to, to what Joe said and Messi, I, I think it's different because I think in all the other teams and all the other players that you're mentioning, uh, Maradona, um, Pelé, R9 even, I think their teams would have progressed without Messi. Whether they, whether they would have won it or not, I don't know. I don't think Argentina get out of the group stage if Messi's yeah, not in that team. Great. So the fact that he took it upon himself to decide the whole World Cup and after, after a game where against Saudi Arabia where you, you're debating whether he's still got the magic and all of a sudden he goes, yeah, I've still got it. I'm going to show you every, in every other game. And he just selective in his moments, but his moments were so decisive. He, they won the World Cup. How has his game evolved then from his time at Barcelona to now at PSG? I mean, he's, first of all, he's one of a kind. He, he is a true football genius. This is young Messi. And, you know, speed and the power and the technique and the dribbling is, is unmatched, mm. almost. In terms of Maradona, um, it's probably the only real comparison. And uh, at this time, I think he was just the best dribbler. But I think the one thing for me that sets him apart, I think, is his football intelligence. For me, mm. I don't think it's a fair fight because it feels like he's a second ahead of everybody else. Yeah. I think he sees the game a second quicker. And I think that is a true genius. And uh, the way he's been, his longevity, Seema, is, is outrageous. Mm. He's, he's thinking the ball with yeah. his weaker foot there. I mean, the guy is just one of a kind. Now we've seen him evolve and playing more in this, you know, come deeper, get on the ball, play as a playmaker. You know, we talked about goals, we talked about assists. He's the perfect football player. Um, that finish is ridiculous. Again, but, I mean, the clips are, are similar, <laughs> and there's obviously it's over a 10, 15 year span. It's just how selective he is in doing it. I think. I don't it's think it's quick yeah, anymore, is yeah, it? Yeah, and or oh, not as many times where he was doing it eight, nine times yeah. in his early career. Now he's doing it three, four. I, just I was think... watching him, Joe. Sorry, I was watching him at the World Cup with some greats of the game, and and he was strolling around doing nothing off the ball, and there was like, ah, he's not doing this. He can't do this. He can't do that. And it's almost like like what Owen says, football intelligence. He sees the game 
more than yeah. anyone else. It's like, like a boxer. Then he comes alive there, yeah. doesn't he, yeah. Joe? Like a boxer in the first two rounds when they're having a look at the opponent and they see what they're doing. That seems to be the first 15, 20 minutes, he strolls around and he, he's looking for weaknesses in the opposition. I've never seen a player that can do that. Usually, you're on the pitch and you, us three would have been flat out trying to be good in every moment of the game, good off the ball, good on the ball. He's like, I'm just going to have a minute here. I'm going to have a look. I'm going to ghost over to the left. I'm going to ghost over to the right. I'm going to drop in here. What do they do when I do this? What do the defenders do? He has a look at the opposition and then he figures it out and then it gets to a certain point and then he'll burst into action. He can't do that, like Jolien said, six, seven, eight times a game now, but two, three, four times a game is still enough yeah. to, to win the games at the very, very highest level. Messi has also set numerous match records in Spain and has won La Liga on 10 different occasions. Messi has won the Ballon d'Or seven times and has won the European Golden Shoe six times for being the highest goalscorer in Europe. He is also the second highest goalscorer in the history of the Champions League behind Cristiano Ronaldo and has won Europe's most prestigious club competition on four occasions, all of them with Barcelona. Messi had to leave Barcelona in 2021 due to financial reasons and he joined Paris Saint-Germain in France where he won League One in his very first season. Messi also won his first senior national trophy with Argentina for the first time in his international career in 2021 after leaving La Alba Celeste to the trophy in Brazil. He had earlier won an Olympic medal in Beijing 2008 and later added his second trophy with Argentina following the finalissima win against European champions Italy in 2022. Messi has also finished runners-up in the final of the FIFA World Cup and was awarded the Golden Ball at the World Cup in 2014. He also lost back-to-back -back Copa America finals with Argentina in 2015 and 2016, but despite those setbacks, the Argentine is the player with the second most number of trophies in world football after his former teammate Danny Alves. However, beyond statistics, numbers, and trophies, what truly sets Messi apart is a simple fact that he is a genius on the football pitch. Despite being recognized as one of the greatest goalscorers in history, he is also regarded by many to be the best playmaker in the world in the modern era. As a result, Messi can be said to be a complete player who not only scores a bundle of goals but also sets up his teammates and influences his team's overall play. Therefore, it can be added that Messi is the greatest footballer of all time and the GOAT of the 21st century.